Welcome to Get Mojo, where we do the research so you don't have to. In this video, we're looking at the top five must-have tools you'll need to assemble your own gardening starter pack. Tackling a garden can be a bit like climbing a very steep, very tall mountain with seemingly no end in sight. However, if you have the right tools, your life can be made a whole lot easier. So if you're a newcomer to the gardening world and need to assemble some essential tools, don't go anywhere. We've got you covered. We've scoured the web to present our top five must-haves for the ultimate gardening starter pack. Before we begin, be sure to subscribe to Get Mojo and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos. Okay, first up, a solid pair of gloves. From weeds to thorns and stones to sticks, your hands are put through the ringer when gardening. So a solid pair of gardening gloves is essential. What's also important, however, is maintaining dexterity. Essentially, you want a tough pair of gloves that allows you to freely move your fingers. This pair from Cool Job is ideal, as they have a rubberish surface for grip and protection, and yet are super slimline and have breathable backs so your hands won't get too sweaty. The Digging Essentials Sure, a spade was probably at the top of your beginner's list anyway, right? But beginners often don't fully realize what other digging necessities will be needed on a regular basis. We recommend that you get, at a minimum, a spade, a fork, and a hand trowel, which should allow you to tackle the majority of digging tasks. Finding a good spade with solid edging capabilities is a must, as this can help cutting through turf and soil as well as digging. Loppers and Pruners Okay, so we've talked about digging, but what about cutting? From trimming small twigs to cutting branches, having proper cutting tools is very important. And that's where loppers and pruners come in. Pruners are great for tidying up trees, plants, and flower beds, whereas loppers are better for heavy-duty jobs like cutting chunky branches. Tools like shears are important too, but for a starter pack, we'd argue that pruners and loppers are the big two when it comes to cutting. A lawnmower. The perfect lawn is the dream, right? Well, if you want your grass to stay healthy, you need to keep it short to at least two to three inches in the growing seasons. If you want to get technical, we'd argue that a battery operated lawnmower like this one offers a nice sweet spot in the lawnmower market as it gives you the untethered freedom of being cordless, but avoids the somewhat intimidating idea of having to fill up with gas. And battery operated mowers offer pretty impressive run times, usually at around an hour. A versatile, adjustable garden hose. Cutting your grass is important, of course, but keeping it hydrated in the dry season is just as key. Sprinklers can be a great investment, but if you want greater control over how your lawn, garden, and flower beds are getting properly watered, then a garden hose, preferably one with multiple different shower modes, is absolutely essential. Ideally, you'll want a hose that can reach right to the back of your yard and that has a light sprinkler or mist setting as well as a heavy jet stream one, just in case. The more versatile your hose is, the more you'll get out of it, and that includes cleaning your pavements and cars. So which of these tools should you buy? Well, in terms of complete garden and lawn care, all of these products are essential in our opinion. However, you're not going to get very far without digging and cutting tools, so maybe prioritize those first and go from there. Stay tuned to Get Mojo for the most complete video product reviews. Check out this other recent clip from Get Mojo and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos.